Your Excellencies, a message from the Prime Minister of India, Sri Narendra Modi. Excellencies, dear friends, we continue to face the challenges of a global pandemic that has proven to be the most serious challenge to humankind in recent decades. Unlike the early days of the pandemic, we now have a significantly larger amount of information about the nature of the disease and its impacts. However, true understanding of the solutions, whether preventive or therapeutic, is still a work in progress. Science-based research is the only torch that can guide us. International collaboration and research is critically important for finding effective diagnostics, vaccines and cures. The entire world's hope is built on such success so that our economies and societies can return to normalcy and progress. That is why an event like the Global Goal Unite for Our Future Summit is important. It brings together the best competencies and resources available in different countries to strengthen a common fight against the virus. I commend the leadership of the European Commission and Global Citizen in spearheading this effort. This initiative also demonstrates the resolve of the global community to not forget the most vulnerable parts of the world. We must be responsible towards countries that lack the resources, both financial and human, to protect their populations effectively. None of us will be safe as long as the virus continues to find sanctuary in any part of the world. The Indian pharmaceutical industry has long been the source of affordable drugs, especially for the developing world. It has repeatedly demonstrated its ability to provide quality vaccines and medicines at scale and at low cost. Menafribac, Hebe and Pentavalent, rotavirus and pneumococcal vaccines are just some of the examples where our industry has contributed to reducing costs and ensuring global availability. Vaccines sourced from India take care of two-thirds of the immunization needs of the world's children. We also have considerable capacity in research and development, both within public and private sectors. Excellencies, India is one of the world's oldest civilizations with a millennia-old tradition of healing. Our ancient wisdom in the form of yoga and Ayurveda remains a shared heritage of humanity as a source of holistic health. We see it also as a civilizational duty to play a leading role in tackling the latent health crisis too. India stands ready to contribute its research and manufacturing capacity as well as the best practices we have developed for expanding immunization and healthcare within our vast population for the benefit of the world. Once more, I wish all success to the present summit. Thank you.